What's up? Welcome to my, uh, Let's Play My Sims 4 series. This is my family, and I'm gonna show you everybody around and everything, but first we're gonna take a look at the house. This is the, uh, Sunny Bungalow. That's what I called it. It's a cute little beach bungalow. Uh, just like a little bedroom house, a couple of bathrooms. We'll give you a quick tour, and then we'll go over the things for our first episode here. Uh, over here, since there's only two bathrooms in the house, I went ahead and added some extra showers and pissers in here, so that they won't get embarrassed and die from embarrassment, which happens pretty often in this game. Over here we have a little, like, I don't remember what you call these things, but little well, kind of outdoor car top thing. It's got a bar and gym equipment over here with a couple of easels too, and of course a skeleton just chilling. We live on the beach, of course. Well, next to the beach, I guess. Just right there. Over here in the back, the yard will give us a pool with the uh, pineapple pizza floaty. Of course, everyone's favorite. Freaking cannon. Grill. Trash can. Outdoor dining. A uh, hot tub. A little tent for the kid. A uh, freaking table would work into. And some benches that are clipping into the foundation. Let's go inside, shall we? So I built this all by myself. Um, if you guys didn't know what you don't, um, I've been playing The Sims for like many years, so I basically know how to do everything in this game. Let's, let's go ahead and get in the house. Let's start with the bottom floor here. Lights are off. That sign is broken again. She got some pictures here. Some nice pictures of the family. Of course, this is the uh, one piece let's play in the little beach house I built. The broken sign. Here's the kitchen. The little dining room. There's a bathroom slash laundry back here. Ah, really nothing much to see there. Palm trees. Love the beachy vibes. It's very cute in here. I, I agree, it's cute. Um, here is the living area, living room, whatever you want to call it. Got a TV, sort of clipping shelf, you know. Can play games and some music in here. Some fish tanks and a couple more photos over here next to our bong. Because of course everyone gets high on this. Let's play. That's the point. And let's go ahead and take it upstairs. Let's see what's upstairs, shall we? Um, I kind of liked for them to all have like uh kind of a sleepover every night so they have beds all next to each other even though i don't think they really work little kind of chill spot in here all their neon signs are broken got a skeleton chilling and a little uh smoke room back here with the hookah and the uh, oil here so you can drink this thing on the water even though it's a house <laughs> So, we can go over the sims now. Everyone that is here, or a member of the crew, except for the fishman guy, because I haven't got to that part of the anime yet. But we can go over, go, go ahead and go over everyone. Here is um, everyone's favorite, Chapa. Uh, you, can't, you can't have a reindeer in the sims. Or, like, any kind of animal. Well, you can have animals, but, like, can't have a reindeer. So, he is a kid. 
I feel like it fits. He's got the uh, cotton candy attire on. Every day, balloon pink. Every day. <laughs> yeah, but he's pretty boring, in my opinion. The other sim that isn't completely accurate, because you can't have a skeleton <laughs> since, but Burke here. I decided to make him darker skinned. I just feel like it fit him, even though he has like a lighter skin and he's human in the anime, but I don't know, I just felt like it fit him because he's got, the, you know, the afro kind of deal. You just gotta make some food, I guess. But here's our other sims. Let's go ahead and look at Robin here. She is a swimming fool. She might as well be a mermaid in this Sims Let's Play. She is swimming literally every five seconds. Um, she is not that accurate, I would say, to the show, but she definitely does justice, especially with some of the outfits I gave her, like her little cross tattoo. And she's got dimple piercings, very cute. The most accurate sim from the anime, I would say, is Frankie here. He is looking at his own laundry. Nowhere to go. Oh, it's kind of hard to follow around, isn't it? And we can take a look at Sanji up here, too. Here is Frankie. Now, this is a very accurate representation, I believe. There's Sanji and Nami, too. He gotta take a look at him. Here's Luffy. He's always angry. Very fitting, I guess. Just two more here. I downloaded a bunch of these Sims. Have a bunch of mods to get some of their cosmetics to look right. But they all look pretty good, in my opinion. Here's one of my favorite characters is Sanji over here. I think he turned out pretty accurate. Um, even though I had to find a hair that completely covered one eye. Downloaded this one and he's got the uh, signature eyebrows too. So you can kind of see. Here is a crowd favorite. Sora over here. Chilling. Yeah, chilling. Of course, he's got the green hair and the earrings. Very important for him the earrings. So, I'm glad he's got that. And here's Nami here. She's a little big today. She looks pretty accurate too, uh, I agree. But now that we actually introduced all the Sims, I need to get some things done around my Sims house because shit ton of things are broken. Oh. Actually, I forgot to show off my favorite sim in probably my favorite character in the show is Usopp here. Of course, the glorious um, Usopp. No, he is God, I guess. Um, of course, I he's rocking the pretty pretty dark skin tone. Very accurate for him in the show. He is not the color he's supposed to be. Um. It's got a pretty dark skin so here, and he looks really good in my opinion. And he is going to help us out around the house by using his handiness skill to fix these broken neon lights that are here. You know, it's a pretty simple living here. You know, not many hectic things go on, but... You know, we might throw a party later and kill some people, so... You know, that could be fun. Most of the time, though, my sims just usually sit around and dance. Can we got, like, a bunch of radios in here, maybe? You gotta have music to be alive, don't you? I really like this house that I built them. I, I gave them another house too. It was 
more of a modern sort of beach house, but it was really big, and when you have, like, freaking nine sims here, it runs really slow in a big house, so I gave him a smaller house, and it's really easy to take track of the sims and actually play, and I think this house is way cuter and fits the theme a lot better. So he's gonna fix up these neon lights for us, so I, I kinda, I never had a sim really get up the hand you know, because the sims would be cute. money. Oh, is it like a piggy bank? Let's put a hundred dollars in there then. Oh my god. He's improving his hand new skill fair as he's reached level two. Um I'm not gonna apologize for my, uh, crack voice. Nope. Um, if this video, like, gets a bunch of views, or, like, a bunch of likes, I probably will do a part two, because I really do enjoy playing this household. It's pretty fun, in my opinion. Since part of the series, the part of the anime I'm on, the actual anime, um, freaking everyone, like, died, so... This is a good time to bring them all back together in the sims, I guess. <laughs> After it's all done, let's have him scratch the left part to this actually get us money. Yeah, search for parts. Is this boring? I don't know if this is boring. No, but I'm having a good time. Are you going to put money in there? Name Bob the cat. Bob the cat. Can you put money in there? So, what's this mean? Oh, you can take the money out, I guess. He's salvaging these for parts. Look at the parts. See, he's got nine of these things. Uh, they're pretty expensive to sell, yeah. That'd be 90 bucks, about $10 per thing there. I don't sound like this is way. <laughs> eco soon, eco soon. Oh, man, it's okay. Oh, he got to take this. He got to take a boost. Um, since I have like 10 billion lots in my game, I can actually go here and. So it needs all of them. This way I don't have to actually make sure they have to go to the bathroom every five seconds. Or he is freaking swimming in the foundation of the ground. <laughs> well, let's go ahead and do a few more things that we have here and take up the opportunity to actually get behind the title and smoke some weed. Zoro here has got like four packs of weed. Okay, so yeah, 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 yeah. I think Luffy has like four bombs or anything. Yeah. Some plays. They'll actually come in here. That's gonna be crazy. Let's just watch. Let's put in that Gaza. Look at the goo. Yes, this is something you can do in the Sims. He just got to download the mods for this. You know, I might have him clean up that mess after he's gonna make it. I can't deal with messes in my house in the Sims. <laughs> 